All right, so for the wiring, uh, the factory GZE harness uh, only comes with these two uh, main ECU plugs right here. Uh, and Well, really, it's one, but it, it's two. Uh, but it doesn't come with the third one, so you usually end up having to source this from a junkyard or something like that. Uh, and this one has most of your main powers for um, these these two are basically main power. This is the main relay. It's called MREL. And then uh, a couple of these are just uh, transmission control and diagnostic and stuff. And then over here, um, basically everything else. And I don't really unpin anything because, I don't know, I'll just leave it in the harness or whatever. It doesn't really bother me. Um, kind of less stuff to mess with. But basically where you end up is you need to power... Um, a few different things, uh, one of which, um, sorry, you'll also end up with this plug. Uh, this probably will come with the harness. You probably won't have to source this, but again, this has a bunch of uh, different functions and power and things like that. One of which is the power for your uh, ignition coils, uh, injectors, and a couple other things. So you'll send power to that. You'll send power to the MREL. Um, I'm sending power to the transmission control. There's a uh, power and then economy function. And then uh, there's one other thing, and I'm failing to remember what that is, but it, you power that too. Um, all this is uh, on Wilbo 666's uh, diagrams, and you kind of have to go between the JZA80 and the uh, Aristo harness because the Aristo has, is closer to the GS300. Uh, that'll give you all your uh, transmission control, your power control for your transmission and that kind of stuff, which makes a big difference in how it shifts. Uh, we did it on the Celica and it shifts nice and firm. It's like it's got a shift kit. So uh, Once I get all these uh, wired up to relays correctly, and then uh, these are just outputs for uh, temperature, uh, oil pressure, tachometer, and starter, uh, which I'm just going to use from the uh, Mercedes signal. So once I get it all buttoned up, then I'll do a, uh, a wrap-up video on the electrical stuff, but it's pretty easy for a 2JZ.